Hello, I'm Bradley and welcome to my channel. And today I want to talk about Viviscal. Now, hopefully you would have seen from my channel that I have been on a Viviscal journey, which ended a month ago and I decided to end that journey at six months. And throughout that time, I done a check-in, sort of check-in point of how I was going when I first started the supplement growth program. Then at one month, then at three months, then at six months. And I done some flash sort of drop-ins and sort of updates of how the program journey was going um, throughout that time. And I, that went incredibly well. I had so many compliments, so many sort of comments and questions and things. It was really, really fantastic to be quite honest with you. I really, really enjoyed doing it. I decided to leave it at six months, but I have still continued to take the program, which is Viviscal Supplements, which, of course, if you haven't seen them, I'm just going to show you them very, very quickly. So as you can see, Viviscal here, this is my three month supply, which I bought a month ago now because I intend to take them for another three months, which will take me to nine months, of course. How do they look? So in a blister pack like this, as you can see here, and this is me taking the tablets, one in the morning, one at night. Um, literally take it with your breakfast first thing in the morning and then late at night have the last thing before you go to bed or with your evening meal. Very often I take it with an evening meal and there's no problems in terms of how it makes you feel. doesn't make you feel nauseous, doesn't make you feel full, uncomfortable, doesn't give you sort of indigestion, doesn't repeat on you and it doesn't make you feel bloated either. What does it do? So Viviscal helps the health of your hair be at its absolute optimum. So throughout my six month journey I noticed an improvement in my skin which I still continue to see. I noticed an improvement in the strength and the condition of my hair, which has allowed me to have my hair highlighted. And as you can see, as I bend my head here, it's very highlighted. And I've had this done once back on July. And then about a month, maybe six weeks later, I had the front a little bit more brighter. And then actually yesterday, I had the highlights full throughout my hair just for the fall season. I absolutely love autumn um, throughout the year. It's a season I absolutely love um, and I just wanted a bit more of a change, a bit more sort of a vibrancy about my hair. Um, and just I find that it really does make me feel good when my hair looks good. And this is something which I really, really liked exploring with this year. So I had this done yesterday and I also had an Oplex uh, service treatment, which literally just absolutely made my hair feel absolutely incredible. So I would certainly recommend that. Um, I don't know if I quite pronounce that there right, so do forgive me. I haven't got the products with me. Is it Olaplex, I believe, or Oplex, however it's described. Um, and I believe that was put in with the colour and the bleaching, which I had. Then afterwards, I had uh, like a conditioning uh, treatment on my hair afterwards, uh, like a perfecter, I believe. If it's called that again, forgive me if not. Um, and then I had the oil part of the service as well, all the way through my hair and then I had it dried off and styled and the shine was just incredible and I can still feel the condition in my hair today. Um, it did add a little bit more in terms of cost so it added £9 to the service but in terms of me having had my sides in the back of my hair cut, the highlights and then the Olaplex uh, service treatment on there it came to £50. It is a bit steep of course but when you think you don't have that very done that often um, I thought that it was great value for money and the people who look after me where I go at the hairdressers where I actually visit locally are just incredible and I always find if you have that rapport and they look after the health of your hair as well not just bothering how much money is at the till at the end of the day which a lot of places are like that I have to admit all they're really worried about is how much money they're taking off you not necessarily if you're happy the health of your scalp the health of your hair and all of those things and it's an amazing team as well who I go to they are all just amazing so that really makes such a difference so if you're not happy with whoever does your hair if it's a cut if it's a color if it's highlights or what have you change change because you will notice a big difference if you have not got somebody what cares about you and your hair then you're in completely the wrong person's hands. And lastly, what I would always say, if you are thinking about going for having highlights or anything like that, whether you're a man or a woman, always see a professional, particularly if you haven't ever done it before. Having darker colours is completely different because if you have got lighter, there is so much scope for things to go wrong. And at the end of the day, you want it to look good. It's all very well achieving that colour. But if the integrity and the health of your hair and your scalp isn't there afterwards, then you literally just completely almost you go on against what you're trying to achieve because to have a great shiny sort of healthy color such as lighter hair which takes a lot of looking after a lot of moisture a lot of condition then really you are kind of sort of starting yourself off on completely the wrong foot what you're trying to achieve really so vitally important i would always suggest seeing a professional so back to viviscal now this i would always put for the last six months as i said i've seen so many benefits with that my hair seems to grow to a more 
potential. Um, when I say that, I mean that I thought my hair was growing fine before this, um, and before the time where I started Viviscal, I really noticed a difference in, I was very stressed out at the times, and I still am at times stressed out with health-related problems, which, as you know, if you do watch my channel, that's still going on in the background. We're studying, we're starting a new job, and of course, we can just be naturally stressful in our lives. Um, it's important to sort of try and hone that in sometimes, which I do try to do, and it's important to always have a really healthy uh, diets rich in vitamins minerals fruits vegetables and of course exercise as well is huge and keeping stress under a hole too Viviscal is great for supplementing all of this as well, because of course sometimes some of that isn't easy for all of us, but Viviscal is great because what it has inside here is the marine protein complex, which is the hero product behind Viviscal. Viviscal is slightly different for men and women in their supplement ranges, but they both have that marine protein complex in there, which personally I put down to how I have seen the thickness in my hair improve, the fullness, the sort of the strength, the character come back in my hair, which is just absolutely brilliant. Um, it also has vitamin C in here, it also has zinc, it also has flaxseed extract, and it also has horse toe extract, and those ingredients as well look after the cell formation in the scalp of continually aiding to grow healthy, full hair as well. Now, I would say when you notice this in your hair, it's not going to be in the first couple of weeks, it's not even going to be in two three month time period of where you are in your journey it's different for everybody is it going to work for everybody i can't say it might do it might not i'm hoping that it would work for everybody but when you think how complex hair related problems are and hair loss is it's worth a try it really really is worth a try because if you haven't noticed too much of a change you do know that you can take peace from that your hair and your scalp and that whole sort of complex makeup of that hair regrowth cycle is being nourished by those ingredients within Viviscal. Now there is a shampoo which you can actually boost the system with as well, which helps hair grow thicker and fuller and appear hair to be thicker and fuller when you style your hair as well. There's also the same in the women's range too, and there's an elixir spray which you can also have in the women's range too. I don't believe that it would hurt really mixing both, to be quite honest with you. So that would be certainly something which you could try as well. Now, Viviscal works in stages. So in stage one, two, and three, and four. So stage one, which I'm just going to refer to from the back here. Okay, so stage one, hair follicles are supported through consistent intake of protein and nutrients in each tablet. Stronger nails are often the first sign that Viviscal is working. And that's when you're starting up until about month one. Then at month three, we go into a starting to approach stage two, which is thin and wispy hair is strengthened. Look out for baby hairs appearing. And when this happened for me, I did start to feel short prickly hairs among my hairline and in an area just in here so not my crown just in a bit and I really did notice a difference but I wanted to sort of keep that under part in the pun under my hat a little bit I didn't want to show that on my journey until a little bit later so stage three and this is where you're approaching the six month mark now breakage thinning continues to decline encouraging normal healthy hair growth and then after the six months which I'm in now hair looks noticeably stronger and healthier so at about the five month mark, I confirmed it on my channel and in my journey that I was starting to really see the thicker, fuller hair appear, to be quite honest with you. And then towards the six month period when we talked about it, I'm absolutely noticing. And now I've hit my seven month mark with Viviscal. I've really noticed that the strength in my hair, the vibrancy in my hair, and it's like it actually has character. It doesn't just sit there flat and fine on my head. Now, you may think that this is thick hair, but this is actually a lot of smoke and mirrors, as I always say, because there is more air than hair here, but it looks full, it looks thick, and with the help of Viviscal, my hair is thicker in my head, on my head rather. And this is where it gets really interesting. So yesterday I had the highlighting service done on my hair, and I had the Olaplex uh, service treatment uh, on the condition of my hair and the repairing after the colouring process after. Now this is all about why I'm doing this, this clip today, because of course I was going to stop talking about Viviscal and my Viviscal journey, and I was just gonna carry on taking it. So about the nine month mark, have a bit of a break, and then go back to it next year just that sort of boost throughout the seasons just to keep my hair as thick and full as possible prevention is always better than cure and this is when it hit me so yesterday i had I went through the process, of course, of having the highlights done throughout foils, lots of waiting, um, but it was a really quite enjoyable process. Had a bit of a laugh yesterday with the person who was doing it. They look after you really, really very well where I go, um, and this is what really knocked me back. 
So after all of the treatment and the Olaplex was washed off my hair and I was left with real, real soft, shiny hair, the person uh, then went on to cut my hair. So I didn't have the top cut, but I had the sides, which is a 1, then into about a 2, uh, sorry, 0 0.5 into about a 1, and then up to about a 2 here, and then you've got a lower line, and then it just arrows down towards the nape of my neck, which I always have, just so with my hearing aids, you see my hairstyle at the back rather than my hearing aids first of all. And you'll notice I say that quite a lot throughout my hair clips. But this is what really knocked me back. When she was drying my hair, I always think I have real fine hair. And sometimes if it's not styled right, it can be a little bit see-through, particularly if I use wet products. And this is the first time in a long time somebody has actually said to me, whilst I was drying my hair, isn't your hair thick, Bradley? Excuse me? And honestly, my jaw dropped. Because going back into 2015, when I was having my hair cut, the same person said to me, not my crown, just in here a little bit, said to me that my hair was getting a little bit more see-through and the density wasn't so much there. A little bit later on, I had a patch reform here in the front. And then that patch thinned out to sort of like a not a bit of a rectangle shape, but quite diffused. Main patch here like a golf ball, and then it got thinner in the front here. Mm, absolutely. So I went from being told four and a half, five years ago, that my hair was really fine in places and I had a patch here which they would comb over and style over so you didn't see it to yesterday no one has said this to me okay, okay my mum very often my brother very often my twin brother very often will say to me your hair looks really really good your hair looks really really thick but I know that a lot of it as I say is smoke and mirrors it's a lot of sprays, a lot of thickening sprays, a lot of root lifting sprays, how I dry my hair, different tricks, that type of thing to make it look thick. But we all know if your hair is actually quite fine. My hair is actually quite fine. I've just got lots of it. There's a difference. But yesterday, when we were in the middle of styling my hair afterwards, and all of a sudden, the person who cuts my hair and has done so for a long time, has actually come out and said to me, your hair's actually quite thick, Bradley. Your hair's, isn't it really thick? And it was a, a concoction of those things, which was about three different comments about the thickness of my hair. And that actually it was thick. It was fine hair, but it was thick. There was lots of it. And the only thing I can put that down to is Viviscal. I am not represented. I have nothing to do with Viviscal. I'm not affiliated by them at all. I wouldn't even know where to start, to be quite honest with you. And I know that sounds cheesy and I know that sounds like that possibly I could just be saying that but to be quite honest with you I am all about honesty I am all about integrity if I was being represented if I was being paid a certain something or whatever have you by Viviscal I would absolutely wholeheartedly tell you because if I was lying why would you want to keep listening to me why would you want to come back to my channel this is the absolute God's honest truth hand on heart I have nothing to do with Viviscal at all. This is just an experience which I tried back in 2015 and I tried Viviscal for seven months back then as well and it really, really helped my hair transform. I seen a huge remarkable difference at about month five. I think it really hit home to me that the strength of my hair, the shine, the condition, the fullness, the thickness really came back in my hair. And I didn't think I had too much of an issue. I was just sort of for prevention I didn't want things to get worse but I actually realized that actually my hair had really quite changed really quite changed now I can do things like highlight my hair I can be a little bit more rough with my hair and I'm styling it I know that sounds crazy but if you're in shorter time sometimes you can be a little bit more sort of you can manipulate it a bit more you can be a little bit more firm with your hair and all that. you don't have to worry about it and that all comes from Viviscal and yesterday being told it's actually quite thick, Bradley. Knocked me for six. That's why I'm doing this clip today. That's why I really just want to sort of put that out there, that I still do get comments about if this is real, if Viviscal is as good as what I say it is. It wholeheartedly is. I take one tablet in the morning, one tablet at night. Sometimes if I if I want to, I buy the Viviscal shampoo. I don't use it every day. I don't think you have to use it every day at all. Personally, I find it's good to change shampoos because your hair very often on my hair can get used to it. So I find for more volume and things, or if you're creating that condition at the moment, I'm using conditioning shampoos and conditioners uh, for the, for of course, the color which I've just had done highlighted as well. But 
I put it all down to the marine protein complex in Viviscal. And you know what? It's not a lot. One tablet in the morning, one tablet at night. It is an investment. I will be honest. It is an investment. But I'll be very open with you. A place here in the UK, which I get my Viviscal, always seems to be a lot cheaper, is Holland and Barrett. Now, if you go directly to Viviscal, I think for a three-month... Uh, package of this is £90. Viviscal from Holland Barrett, I recently paid £65 for this because of a flash offer and um, they had this reduced as well. Um, but very often if you sign up, I do find to Holland Barrett that you get voucher codes and things sent through to you as well. Again, I am not represented, I am not affiliated by any company whatsoever at all. This is just if I find a company which I really, really like, I will tell you about it. Okay, so I hope you've really, really enjoyed my clip today. I certainly have. Do you know what? I ended my Viviscal journey at six months, but do you know what? I may well update you again at eight months. I may well update you again at nine months, but I will probably stop again at nine months, have a bit of a break, and then go back to it in the spring. But in terms of this colour, I styled my hair for the first time today since having it highlighted yesterday. Um, I didn't wash it last night even though it had product in because of course I had the, uh, the Olaplex treatment service in so I didn't want to sort of mess with that going on. But look how silvery, look how silvery my hair is. And I just find, isn't that incredible? And you can actually see that the front of my hairline is really filled in, which is amazing. It really, really is amazing. Back in 2015, I had a, I had a patch just behind here. Never ever thought that I would get my sort of my my normal sort of uh, what I call thickness back, actually. Um, so it was great to be told that yesterday. That's why I'm doing this clip today. So there is hope. And you know what? If you try something, even if it's not Viviscal, if you try something, prevention is better than cure. Do not wait. And the first thing I would always recommend is if you're noticing changes in your hair, speak to a pharmacist, speak to your family doctor, speak to a medical professional, because it doesn't necessarily mean to say that it's your hair. It doesn't necessarily mean that it's male pattern balding or female pattern balding or thinning, whatever you want to call it. Your hair, I always say, is the expression of good health inside. Whatever you are inside, your hair is going to be. Whatever you consume, your hair is going to be. Alcohol, smoking. Again, you have to have that balance. You have to be healthy for you then to have a healthy head of hair. I hope that really, really helps. And I've really, really enjoyed doing this. I hope you've enjoyed watching. If you have any comments for me, please leave them down below. I enjoy getting comments from my subscribers and all different viewers on my channel. It is absolutely amazing. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. It means the world to me. So until next time, we will see you then. Bye for now.